Hello, on to the letter T for this alphabetical World Cup. We have 15 countries this time around. Just the one group, nothing like that crazy S group we just had with three different groups because there were 42 teams and they had to be divided equally or equally as possible. So 14 in each. And then also a final, so there was four videos on that one. From now on, it's just one video each as 15 for this T. We've got eight teams for U coming up. We've got four for V, six for W, three for Y, and three for Z to enjoy. So without further ado, let's go through these countries that start with the letter T. And feel free to put in your early predictions on who you think is going to top the table and represent the letter so we have Tahiti, 162nd in the world. We've got Tajikistan, 168th. Tam Atami Elam, 274th. Got Tanzania, 133rd. Thailand, 145th. Tibet, 288th. Got Togo, 101st. Got Tonga, they're one of the lowest ones, 279th. Trinidad and Tobago at 119th. And you got Tunisia, 49th. And then scroll over. Got Turkey in 24th. They are the favourites here. Got Turkmenistan, 166th. Tuts and Kagos Islands, 238th. Tu Tuvalu, 276th. And you got two Sicilies, 245th in the world there. So who do you think? It's going to win it here. You have to think it's probably going to be between Turkey and Tunisia, but can someone ask scores a big surprise and go on and represent the letter T? So everyone will get to play each opponent once. So there'll be 14 games for every different country in a neutral venue stadium. So no home court disadvantage. And Nisha Shell. See who leads the way, who finishes second, and who finishes all the way down in the last spots. And some of these clubs or countries just want to get as high as they possibly can because they don't have any real shot of winning this thing. So, group and tournaments, and scroll down and kick off and zoom out, wait for this thing to load, click this eight spots. And let's have a look at these results. So keep an eye out on your favourite countries there. Or countries that you're interested in. Or ones that you're from. So you've got Tanzania winning 8-0. Thailand winning 8-0. A good 5-2 game between Togo and Tonga. Yes, 17-0 Togo and Tibet. So I'm looking for those high scoring games. Or just games with quite a few goals. Or the excitement of the top. Countries playing each other, if you can see them. To get an idea who is going to win it before you see that table. So Turkmenistan, Tunisia, 2-2 two, two draw. So a bit of a slip up there for Tunisia. But is that going to be costly? Turkey winning 8-3 against two Gos and Kagos Islands. Well, fair play of the Turks and Kagos Islands there to get three goals against Turkey. A 9-2 fuller there for Tunisia against Turks and Kagos. Yeah, Turks and Chaos scoring quite a few goals, to be fair. 4-2. Scoring another two there, so... I would expect them to be... Conceding a lot and not scoring... Any at all, really. Surprising. So they might be an overachiever. Like a, um... Consolation reward, possibly. Trophy. Might want to give them a turkey against the bet. Ends 21-1. So after all those results, who ends up winning this thing? It is Turkey. So well done to Turkey. 12 wins, 1 draw, 1 defeat. Scoring 100 goals. Jesus. 13 conceded and 37 points. Tunisia and oh, Trinidad and Tobago, I should say. They came in second place. 12 wins, 2 defeats. Only scoring 67 goals, but conceded fewer with 11. 36 points. It's interesting the table there because got teams that's better at defending and teams that's a lot 
better at scoring. We've got Togo there coming in third. 11 wins, 1 draw, 2 defeats and 34 points. And Tanzania ends up having the best defence. Who would have thought that? With 10 wins, 2 draws, 2 defeats. 40 goals scored but only 9 conceded 32 points. Got Tunisia in 5th place. They managed to get 31 points. And there was a big 6 point drop to Tahiti. With 25, Turkmenistan in 7th place. Managed to get 24 points. Got Thailand in 8th, 22. Turks on Kagos Islands. They managed to win 4 games with 13 points collected in total. Two Sicilies finishes 11th with 12 points. Tibet in 12th place, 9 points. Tuvalu, 7 points. Tonna with 3 points. And at the bottom there was Tamil Elam with just the one draw and 5 goals scored, 106 conceded. So no one wanted to finish in that position, but unfortunately had to go to someone. And it is Tamil Elam. But yeah, big congratulations to Turkey. They will represent the letter T as they take on the other 24 alphabetical World Cup winners and see who ends up winning this whole thing in Stage 2 and Stage 3 that is still to come. Feel free to let me know who you fancy to do the job. Who do you have winning U, V, W, Y and Z that is still to come. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and this series. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and comment below anything else that you might want to discuss.